Hey everybody, my name is Becky and I welcome you to my muscle function video series. Today I'm going to go over the peroneus tertius muscle, also known as the fibularis tertius muscle. I'm going to go over its location, which includes the origin and insertion, following that with its functions, and then finally providing you an exercise or two so you know how to strengthen this muscle. So let's get started with the location of the muscle so we know what we're talking about, and then we'll go on from there. So the peroneus tertius muscle is originated from the lower distal anterior surface of your fibula and then runs down on the front of the foot down to the base of the fifth metatarsal. So just so you know where I'm talking about for this muscle, I'm going to go ahead and show you where it is on my body and then I will provide you an illustration to show you exactly what I'm talking about. As you can see here, you can see the top of my foot. So again, the origin of the peroneus tertius muscle is along the anterior third of your fibularis. Okay? And then it runs down along the front of your foot to the base of the fifth metatarsal. So just so you know what this particular muscle looks like, I'm going to go ahead and insert an illustration for you right here. Okay, so now that you know what this muscle actually looks like and where it is located on our bodies, I'm going to go ahead and move on to its functions. Now this particular muscle is actually an assister muscle. Um, Fun fact about this muscle, it's actually sometimes referred to as the fifth tendon as the extensor digitorium longus muscle. And then uh, also it is absent in some people. So to move on to its functions, again, um, it is an assister muscle, so it doesn't technically have any primary functions. Um, however, there are two functions this particular muscle has. One is dorsiflexion of the foot. And now let's say your foot is flat on the floor, bottom of the foot, top of the foot. You would be pulling your toes towards the sky or the ceiling. Okay. So that is dorsiflexion of the foot. Also, it performs eversion of the foot as well. So again, like the last two videos I have gone over, you're looking at tilting that bottom of the foot away from the body. So now that we know where it is and what it does, now we can move on to some exercises. Again, um, some people do not have this particular muscle. Um, I'm not even sure if I have this particular muscle. However, um, doing exercises for this muscle will not only help strengthen this muscle, but will strengthen other muscles within your foot and ankle and so on and so forth. So it is not something I would completely avoid, but just um, kind of keep in mind that this muscle may not be on your body. So I'm going to go over some exercises for you. Um, I will go over some eversions and some dorsiflexions. So check them out right here. Okay, so for the first exercise, we're looking at dorsiflexion. And all I did was wrap a resistance band around both feet. Um, I pretty much had to wrap it around the one and then loop it around the other so it would be tight enough. So all I do is I lay one foot on top of the other and this causes a stretch in the muscle and then I would just simply dorsiflex the foot. So again that's bringing the toe towards the sky. So for the second exercise we are looking at eversions of the foot. You can use a towel. I'm using a pair of gym shorts that are probably not going to work very well. 
they're a little bit slippery. But I just fold them up, put them on the floor, and I place my foot on top. And then I kind of scooch them across the floor by everting my foot. Now you can do this with um, resistance bands or whatever. So just so you know what it looks like, again, you're just, just everting that foot. So you're putting the bottom side out away from the body. Okay? Okay, everybody, so that is it for this video. I hope you guys have learned something and found value in it. If you have, hit the like button. If you have any comments or questions, please feel free to post them below. Um, I think that is pretty much it. Again, I thank you so much, and I will see you all next week.